This is the Scotty Vest Cotton Hoodie. Hi folks, Paul here again. Uh, recently we did a review of a Scotty Vest RFID blocking travel vest, uh, which I thought was absolutely fantastic. The good folks at Scotty Vest have been in touch with me again, shortly after that video posted, to say, you might want to check out our website tomorrow. How could I not? So, dutifully, next morning I checked out the website, and they had a sale on. 30% off to celebrate, which was then Father's Day. 30% off plus half price international shipping. How could you say no? So I didn't. This is their cotton hoodie. The hoodie actually comes in two different flavors. Uh, you have micro fleece and you have the cotton one. I went for cotton because uh, I think it's a bit warm for fleece at the minute. It's like 30 degrees here at the minute. So let's get out of it. It's a very attractive plastic bag. And here we go. Uh, it feels quite heavy actually. Quite good thick material. And as with all Scotty Best products, you get a little diagram of where everything is. So this is the first that I've actually seen it. So let's have a look here. So you have, obviously you have your standard kind of pocket here which has got something inside it. It's a key keeper. So you've got a little key keeper in this outside hand warmer type pocket. And there's another second pocket actually in there as well. So it's kind of divided up uh, front pocket and back. And the other side is going to be the same, I think. Yeah, nice big pocket at the front. And again, another pocket in the back. Oh, what have we found? There's a tiny little pocket inside. Uh, these ones are for, I don't know anything you want really, um, SD cards, something like that. Maybe a little memory stick or something. Um, you also have little zipper pockets on the top, which is quite cool. And they go down about well, hand size, so that's quite good size. And again, another little pocket inside. You maybe stash some notes or something in there. A pretty handy pocket, actually. And the same on the other side. Another pocket there with, again, a small pocket on the inside. Velcro closure. And I think, is that it from the outside? Yeah, that's it from the outside. So let's get into the fun part. Nice chunky zippers, work really well. Actually, the, the zippers that Scotty Vest use are really good. I really like them. Uh, inside, it's got a nice soft kind of brushed cotton feel. Okay, so over at this side we have, starting at the top, oh, they have the, um, this is actually velcroed in place. I don't know if you can see that. And this is for keeping your headphones. So there's like little keepers. You feed your headphones through there. And it's quite handy. Or is that for hanging it up maybe? I don't know, whatever you want really. So, what do we have going down this side? This is kind of like a, uh, it's a kind of cottony finish. Um, small pocket there, not sure what that's for. It looks a bit small for a pen pocket. It's about that size, so. Is that a pen pocket? Pretty small one if it is. Uh, oh no, there's a pen pocket. So this is a pen pocket. What's that one for? Let's have a look at the little, where is the map? My cup, oh, I've lost it. Oh, it's at the bottom of the zip. So let's have a look and see if we can find out what that is. It's a mystery. A little pocket anyway. If you can find something that is roughly that size, then that's what that pocket's for. So pen pocket there. We have 
Ooh, quite a large pocket on that side, which seems to be slightly compartmentalized. There's a segment there. Don't know if you can see this very well, but it kind of is stitched there. So you've got a divided pocket. And they are saying that's for a phone, maybe? Something like that. You've got the mesh pocket in there, so yes, I suppose if that was divided up, you stick your phone in there, that makes sense. It all makes sense in the end. Okay, uh, we have big pocket here. Oh, oh, very big pocket. So this pocket will actually looks to be roughly iPad size. You can get an iPad in there, or Kindle, or anything you want. It has the little slits for your headphones, so you can pipe your headphones up through here. Up to where your ears are. Yes, iPad. Uh, coming down one, we have a shallow pocket for your sunglasses. With a little sunglasses cloth, which has your treasure map on it. So you know where all the pockets are. An eyeglass chamois, apparently. Or chamois, depending on where you're from. So that's that side. On this side, we have another little mystery, tiny Fisher's Base Pen type size pocket. I don't know. Who knows what that's for? That's that's really intriguing. But anyway, uh, I'm going to get sidetracked. So another pen pocket here, and another large pocket with some mystery stuff inside. Ooh, we have more of these. I wonder if we have the same people that wear the Scotty Vest Travel Vest. These little cards came with that as well. Uh, I think... Yes, Johnny Jet. Travel expert. And Steve Wozniak. Lovely. So, uh, you have, again, quite a large pocket. Quite a generous pocket. Goes up quite far too. Goes all the way up there. And divide it up for your phone. So if you're rocking two phones, you've got somewhere to put both. Here, another giant iPad style pocket. So if you had two iPads, your score. Um, so two iPads or Kindle or something huge, magazine, something like that. And another one here. Again, this is, what are they saying this? Travel documents, maybe? Does that look like travel documents? I'm gonna say travel documents. Yeah, that'll work. And this is something, right? I did see this in the uh, promotional material, and I thought, really? Is this a bit gimmicky? But in the hood, they have this. It falls down. <laughs> it's an eye mask. And I thought, when I first heard this, I thought, no, come on. You're, no, that's that's a bit silly. Huh? Um, and then I thought about it, and I thought, well, I've been in the airport where, you know, you've got a layover for a couple of hours, and you try and get your head down, and I usually just pull my baseball cap down over my eyes and, you know, try and catch 40 winks. But I can see the use for this, but I don't know. I kind of wish it was detachable or it doesn't seem to be retained in any way I think if maybe they had like some velcro or something oh 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 no the magnet things that the Scotty vest uh, travel vest has yeah put some of those in keep it up in place that'd be cool just to keep it out of the way because I know fine rightly you're gonna throw this thing on and that's gonna flop over your face and Embarrassment will ensue, and people will be wondering why you don't want me to be disturbed as you're walking to your car. But other than that, this is a really nice piece of kit. I'm glad I, I'm glad I bought it. And at the price that Scotty Vest were kind of selling it for, you really can't say no. Um, there's this travel, this uh, uh, 
This hoodie retails for $95 normally. I got it for 66 I believe. Um, and the half price international shipping. So that, that was an absolute score. Uh, we still had to pay, I think it was around £26 uh, once we got the little ransom note from the, um, the UK customs to say we have your parcel and if you ever want to see it safely you'll pay us money um, so once we got all that squared away I think it was probably it was under £100 I think probably all in which was which is still a very good score so um, I'm very happy with that um, oh another thing I just noticed uh, on the cuffs they have these little cutouts for your thumb so that when you have your thumb when you have when you're wearing the jacket let's put this on this side it's a bit warm to be wearing a hoodie inside, but you have this little kind of so stops the drafts going up your hand or you're up your arm. So that's quite neat as well. I quite like that. Um, it's it's a relatively heavy hoodie, so um, I think it's one for kind of warmer weather. Uh, you got the little Scotty vest, very discreet logo. They used to have a slightly different logo with the S and the, the V on it, but now it's actually quite discreet, which is a nice thing, because you don't really want to advertise that you've got uh, something with loads and loads of hidden pockets and probably loads of expensive tech in it too. Um, but as I think this is probably, I got the cotton one because I thought it would probably be more versatile for wearing the whole year round. The micro fleece one, probably going to be pretty warm. Um, I usually, you know, the cold doesn't really bother me, so I, I kind of went for this one. Um, but it's currently mid 20s nearly up to 30 so i think this is probably going to be set aside for a couple of weeks but this is the uk so uh undoubtedly it will come in useful uh later in the year and i look forward to getting uh, getting somewhere out of this so thanks for watching the video uh click like and subscribe if you want to and if not take care